so we will continue meshing of this part till now we have done the meshing of the circular portion so let's start now zoom in here after this we can continue meshing of this fillets area okay here we have a split that is good okay now go to the mesh uh, in the best select pick up this fillet and hit the roller now here you can see one trial is created so go to number and go to a lesser number again here you can see the flow of mesh is uh, not straight so here what we will do i will create a cut first a cut from here let's say a 90 degree cut again from here to 90 degree again here so with uh, this split we will get a much better mesh flow from here to here let's say similarly we can do this thing on the other side also from here to here here to here again here to here make sure it is a perpendicular cut okay and uh, now i will go to number click on lesser number so 10 here one more thing you have to make sure is on the fillet you need at least two rows of element so make two here similarly two here and two here now we can map them go to map regenerate select this hit the roller so you can see two layer similarly here and map it so with this two layer we can capture fillet in a much better way so now i will go to this best select pick up this one this one this one select all at once similarly here i will select this one this one this one and hit the roller again in the fillet we need two rows similarly we don't need this trial so go to number take 10 here similarly 10 here make two here and this between it is not a fillet so we can take one layer of element here similarly pick it two now go to map regenerate select this one and this one map it and after that one thing we can also do here is we need a proper mesh here so i will create a cut here let's say from this point up to here or any straight line so until here you can see we have a quadrilateral similarly i will try to make a quadrilateral here but right now here we only have three point so i will insert a new hot point here go to insert let's say somewhere here like at the middle of the curve so with this what i will do you can see four here you can see four number of layer so make it four similarly make it four now we have four number of element on opposite sides so go to map select regenerate select this and map it okay it is not working so in this case let's try to mesh it again go to select and mesh it let's try to reduce number of element here so again such type of area can be complicated to mesh so again i will make one more cut from here to here let's say and make element four here and let's say make it three make it make four here so basically what i want to make here is i want to create a map mesh but map mesh is not working here let's say try to select four sided select this face next and it is working now click on finish so you can see this command is working and you can see mesh flow is much better but we have to make sure you can see the angle of this element is very large so if you go to measure pick up this point this point and this point this angle is 164 which is a bigger value but for this for the sake of this example we can consider this close it now let's follow the other area also so here go to best select this one this one this one this one this one similarly select everything here like this and mesh it okay 
so here we need two layer of element again and here number should be reduced so 10 10 10 here this is 2 this is 2 here similarly 2 2 here 2 here 2 here okay now you can remap it but before that you can see there are two trias that are opposite with respect to each other so we can cancel them with each other so for this we can create a split here split here 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 and here okay cancel this now okay uh, again split here 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 and hit the roller again now go to join select this and select this but again here you can see the mesh flow is not good here you can see mesh flow is very small again here is a good so what we will do we will go to this uh, here shell smooth select select all these elements here in the rectangle uh, okay now select this and select this arrow close now mesh flow is much better so we cannot remove these tria from here because of the complicacy of the geometry okay so now i will go to map regenerate select this one this one this one this one just map it okay now again we have such type of area uh, so i will make a cut here make a cut like this so until this cut mesh is good so let's try some more options here so try to increase the number and see what kind of mesh we are getting again mesh is not good so we need to insert a hot point as previously okay now i can make a four sided mesh select this next and select equal number at opposite and finish okay we have to first increase the number make it equal to this 4 similarly equal to this 3 now i will for do four sided mesh click on this then next and finish okay now close this let's go to this area so we have some complicated area here so what i do i will create a cut here from the here to here so with this cut i can increase the number of element make it three okay mesh flow is still not good once again make it two let's try to make it three okay now it is working so we have two trials that are opposite to each other we can use the split option click on this hit the roller now we can combine them so go to join join this and join this to improve this mesh flow you can use again the smooth option select this select these element remove the element from this circle click on this click on this again so you can see in this way we have done the meshing of this complicated area rest of the area it is a completely simple area so in the fillet region i will select the mapped mesh select select only the fillet area let's say now this fillet and this fillet okay here make it two two okay two again not here here two so okay we have to again remap this so go to region rate select this one this one this one and this one hit the roller okay so rest of the area are also plain area so you can use the map mesh here click on this this and this map it okay so these area are also planar area so easier to mesh so after that we will do meshing of remaining area so you can see this is a properly planar surface so it is easier to mesh so i will start meshing with this fillet so go to best select this fillet this fillet select each of them i will make a uncheck on this point to have a better view now rotate this okay 
now match it so we already have two layer of element here and here more in most of the area match flow is good we just have to increase the number of element here on the fillet area this fillet this fillet okay now map it region it this one this one this one and this one and hit the roller so fillet is captured properly similarly make a cut here go to cut make a cut here and to remove this trial go to number make it one number lesser okay now here you can see three four layer of element here four opposite trials okay go to map regenerate click on this now click on this point here again you can follow the same strategy you can insert a hot point here somewhere in between then improve the number let's say make it four similarly four let's see whether map will work or not regenerates like this not so undo this click on this so okay close this go to four sided again slide this face next and finish okay and after that you can also do the mesh of this until this fillet so go to mesh best select here here okay and mesh it so it is a simple mesh no problem after that we have to do meshing of this complicated area we have created some split we can remove them let's say i will remove them like this okay so we are going to start from the basic and we are going to continue this in the next lecture i'm going to save this file for your reference let's say this is my clip mesh file number 2